The Minister of Finance, Zainab Ahmed, says all recovered assets are in the custody of the agencies that affected the, the recovery, while recovered funds are lodged into forfeiture accounts with the Central Bank of Nigeria. The minister gave the insights during an appearance before the House of Representatives ad hoc committee investigating the management of recovered looted funds and assets. National Assembly correspondent Lami Ali reports. The minister, who is making a first appearance before the committee, explained that the status of accounts harboring recovered looted funds are as contained in records submitted to the committee by the Office of the Accountant General of the Federation. She added that amounts were being borrowed from some of the recovery accounts to fund the budget and some exceptional requirements. So what the Ministry of Finance has been managing is the cash, the liquid funds that come uh, that are recovered in Naira as well as in foreign currency. We have had situations where we have had to ask for some exceptional approval to borrow from the funds to be able to meet some uh, exigencies of uh, the day-to-day -day operations of uh, government. We now look at how to pay back again by making provision in the budget for 2022 so that we are able to start paying back this uh, borrowed funds. The committee frowned at this development, pointing out that only the National Assembly can authorize utilization of funds as provided in the Constitution. The committee mandated the minister to set up a technical team which will work with the committee in the ongoing investigation. In its quest for additional information after explanation from the Accountant General of the Federation, Ahmed Idris, on the various transactions in the recovery accounts, the committee has invited the Central Bank Governor, Godwin Amefele, to appear with details of all recovery accounts. In another development, House Committee on Environment has held a public hearing on tree bills which seek to tackle environmental hazards being experienced in the country. These, they are very, very important to the development and growth of our environment. We will also take cognizance of global and national realities and come out with a report that is fixable and factual. The bills are on the Great Green Wall Regulation of Forestry and Environment Trust Fund from the National Assembly, Lami Ali, NCA News.